When settling cities in Civilization VI, it can be confusing why some city centers have two food one production and others have two food two production. This is why understanding terrain types is important. You see, the city center will always default its tile to two food one production, so if the tile you settle on is equal to or less than that, then it defaults to a two one tile. The only exception to this rule is a plain sale tile, which gives one food two production. When settled, the food is increased to two, while the production is kept at two. This makes plain sales great tiles to settle on. Just remember that snow, tundra, and desert provide arrow score when settled on. Resources are kept when settled on, so extra yields beyond the two food one production are kept, like science, gold, and even extra food in production no matter if it is a luxury, bonus, or strategic resource. Removable features like woods, rainforest, and marsh are deleted when settled, leaving only the base tile, while unremovable features like volcanic soil, floodplains, geophysers, and natural wonders are kept, allowing the city center to get their high yields, even after disasters. I'm Riddick Acidic, and I'll see you in the next era.